Cole and Carly Davidson in West Virginia, I believe. West Virginia, when you cross West Virginia, barely crossed over into it. Uh, we've never been here before. The only thing about this shop, it looks like they've got this building here behind us and then another one here across the street. So it may be pretty see, good size. See bikes down in there, I assume. Well, we don't know yet. Maybe, I don't know. And it looks like services right down, down there. So, uh, what we have found out though, if uh, there is a flat spot in Virginia, or the parts of Virginia we've been in, and so far with Virginia, uh, if there's a flat spot, it's man-made. Yeah. I will say though, they, mean, they put a lot into the roads. I, the, I think it's the best roads I've ever drove, drove on, yeah. rode on or whatnot. Uh, and uh, just beautiful country, uh, beautiful country. So we'll check this out. And, and uh, let you know more thoughts on this. So here's the first shot. We're gonna go in it. And as you can tell, well, we just got video. It'll be that one there. So, and uh, service. It's right down here. So, uh, anywho. Let's make our uh, let's make our grand entrance here. Would you would you look, look at that. how beautiful? That's why I'm in love. <laughs> Is that not just gorgeous? Yeah. They'd probably catch you a good deal on it. I will. We'll see. We'll see. Right you know, that's not a road glide. I know. <laughs> oh, look at this fender. <laughs> oh, let's get in there. Oh yeah. Yeah, let's get in there. Man, it's gorgeous. Okay, I don't see any more bikes, so it must be the bike shop down there. Man, I tell you what, this is, that is some gorgeous paint. And it's number 148 of 500. I like that breather too. That, I'm just careful why they went with the smaller uh, engine guards, you know, yeah. the highway bars, the yeah. trash bars, whatever. Just, you know, I've seen pictures of this, Yeah. but man, oh man, it, that pictures does not do this by justice, people. Uh, and there's like some honeycomb in that paint. Yeah. Anyway. That is one gorgeous scooter. Uh, we'll, we'll just kind of keep the camera rolling here. And uh, looks like you got all kinds of motor clothes. Yeah. Well, that's pretty cool right there. Motor clothes. Oh, do they have jeans? Not the ones I need. They do, but I don't think you're that size yet. Yeah, that's a look. Yet. <laughs> but these are the stretchy ones that you love. Yep. But I haven't done your size yet. Yeah. We'll carry on. There's a sleeveless hoodie. Sleeveless hoodie. Is that not pretty different? <laughs> not seen a sleeveless hoodie before. Maybe if you're a boxer or a fighter or something. Yeah. I go sleeveless. Oh. Oh, that's pretty cool. That is pretty neat. Bluefield, West Virginia. I guess we are in Bluefield. It's 
Let's go, Master. So, anywho, we're gonna check this shop out, and uh, we'll uh, we'll be back with you just here, just in a few minutes. This is how you get down to service. Down them stairs right there. Is that not? Uh, that's dangerous for us. Uh, I got a few bikes over here. Talked to the uh, guy in the showroom, and he said uh, that other building. Just had bikes in it, uh, used bikes and stuff like that. Uh, and, uh, and that's where the new bikes go to be cleaned up. Then they come up here. Uh, is this? It's a nice little shop. I take it right here is where all the all the concerts, whatever yep. they do, the fire pit. Yep. Yep. And that's the thing about. The Harley brand. Yeah. You don't see other dealerships doing anything no, like no that. No other brand. There's some bucks lad. I like it real well. Swine shine. I've not tried that before. No. Well, bug slide works awful good. Got the S100. That works good That's too. Really good stuff. Yep. There's some sweet ones. Yep. It's, it looks like it's a lot like that McGuire's. Yep. 12 bucks. Yeah, it's not bad there on that. Shake well before using. Shake it, baby, shake it. I had some in the, in the uh, saddlebag and it busted. I've got some of that at home, actually. Anyway. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah, it's a neat little shop. Hey, got back to the room. Uh, we forgot to do a uh, follow up on the uh, coal yeah. part of Davidson. We just got out for the parking lot and hit the road. We got back you know, it's evening time and just had to think about it, so we thought we'd. Give our input yeah. for grade closing thoughts. Closing thoughts on uh, their their shop. And I'll say I'll give it a thumbs up. Yeah. Yeah, it was a good guy. I didn't much care for the location of it, but it seems like everything in Virginia is on a hill. I mean there's nothing level here. As I said before, <laughs> if it's a flat spot, yeah, it's man made. Man -made. <laughs> so but not saying it's not gorgeous country. Yeah, oh my, beautiful country. Beautiful country. But, uh, yeah, yeah, uh, the dealership, as you can see from the video, it's a nice place, nice little setup. It's uh, it's welcoming. Yep, very welcoming. Yep, people uh, talk to a salesman, uh, talk motor clothes, and everybody was just super nice, you know. Yeah. And uh, whatnot, a super nice shop. I uh, did find out this, the building below down there, was uh, uh, the uh, owner's personal collection of bikes. Yeah. And then that's where they take their new bikes and to be uh, assembled and whatnot, taking off crates and whatnot. But, and then they bring them up. So I did find out about that. You can, and I asked them, you can go down there. Uh, they'll, they'll let you go in there and tour uh, and look at his old bikes and stuff. But uh, yeah, we didn't. We just, just took off. And also found out too, that shop, the shop on the hill was a 1940s Ford dealership, and the one down over the hill 
is a 1940s Chevrolet dealership. Or vice versa, I can't remember when Baboosh was one of the Southern Hills of Ford dealership, I think. So that was some neat history. Yeah, I mean, uh, that's building been there forever. I mean, yeah. you, I mean you can tell. You can tell. That, it had a patina. Yeah. Uh, it was, it was, it was well, well, the whole neighborhood, really. I mean, you can tell mm -hmm. stuff been there for yep. years. Yep. Gorgeous town. Yeah. Gorgeous town. And, of course, we didn't see a lot of the town, but, I mean, it was still a gorgeous town. Uh, I recommend a dealership. Of course, we've had no service there or nothing. Yeah. Uh, but as far as just welcoming the atmosphere the atmosphere yeah. was good uh and yeah the, the woman there i guess in charge of that shop with the motor clothes and everything i mean yes yeah, she was real friendly you asked yeah. a question she had a lot of uh knowledge about that yep yeah. so uh anyway like i said we and, uh, i did find out and this is something i hadn't even thought about yeah and she told us if you notice when you buy a shirt with a pocket on it they're making the pockets smaller now that's one of those politically correct things to, so a pack of cigarettes won't fit your shirt pocket. Oh, that's crazy. Yeah. That's crazy. And also, speaking of pockets, first time ever seen a pocket <laughs> on the right side yeah. and not the left. I don't know what the hell was there, but the, no, I, I guess it'd be for a left-handed person. Yeah. Hey, it's like a left-handed pen. If you don't know what a left-handed pen is, well, well you're, we'll uh, talk about that sometime. The Harley jeans, the little change pocket. Yeah. On every pair of pants I've seen, it's on the right. Yep, Harley. Uh, well, the top pocket. Yeah. The pocket, pocket watch pocket is all that you couldn't ever get a pocket watch in. So anyway, and who carries a pocket watch? Yeah, I always. Well, I never even put change in it. Yeah. You end up with a handful yeah. of change. It just, so anyway. Yeah. We don't know. <laughs> I do know why women's buttons are on this side and men's are on that side. And do you know that answer without looking it up? That's that's my little thing to you. Do you I was told once, but I can't remember I probably told you. Probably did. <laughs> I don't think. I'll tell him off the camera. If you know, put it in the comments without looking it up. Don't cheat. Look it up right in the comments if you know why women's buttons are on the right side you know, and men's button on the left. So, and I'll tell him here just in a minute to refresh his failing memory. Mm. Be sure to subscribe to our channel if you would. Leave us a comment. Yep. Notification yeah, bell. Notification bell. If you like the video. If you don't like it. Say you did. <laughs> give us a thumbs up anyway. <laughs> anyway, until next time, we'll try to give you some more good content or well we'll give you the best we can do. And uh, we'll give you our best. That's all until we can next do. time. See you buddy. See you, buddy. See y'all.